Hello everyone. I am Jung Jung Kim with the YouTube channel Laser Kim, specially for DED hybrid additive manufacturing process. Today I want to talk about how DED hybrid manufacturing technology can work for the MRO industry. We will have the the unique properties when you have multiple materials into a single part. For example, copper can be applied into a local area while the remaining part is made of inconel. And then we will have thermal properties of copper and the strength of inconel. Uh, I have one example, the pump impeller, which is in my manufacturing plan. The, this pump impeller works in very hard working environment. It has a super stress and pressure from the centrifugal front. So it is being requested very highly advanced mechanical capability. So I will make pump impeller body uh, using metal powder stainless steel and the veins uh, using metal powder inconel 625. And then this pump impeller body will have uh, wear and corrosion resistance with the stainless steel and the vein will have a strength of inconel. And uh, the second benefit uh, from the, the additive manufacturing, the, we can have uh, two different metal the part, metals into a uh, single part, uh, but we will have an uh, intermediate buffer layer. We do gradation melting method, then two different uh, the metal molten into a single part but without borderline. This is the amazing benefit from the TED additive manufacturing process. And uh, the third benefit is to make uh, the very highly complicated geometrical part possible here. Let's come back uh, the pump impeller example. Once this impeller is built up completely and then the mill surface is not possible because milling tool cannot get through between the veins. Collision is there. But I can do the, the partial cladding and partial the milling. Again, continue partial milling and uh, partial cladding and partial milling. And then finally, the whole surface of a vein can be mill finished in perfect quality. This is the very good point from the TED hybrid. If I do the same thing in a generic manufacturing method, I have to move this work pieces between the uh, multiple machines from milling machine to editing machine and back to the milling machine. Such a way I will need the number of setups. And the, there will be high risk of scrap whenever setup changes. But TED hybrid additive manufacturing can do them all into a single setup on a machine. Adding features to a part for customization, adding structure to a part for reinforcement, adding cladding uh, to a functional surfaces for wear and corrosion resistance, and finally metal part repair. These are the possible applications uh, from the TED hybrid manufacturing process which will work best for the MRO industry. Thank you for watching.